At 11, one of the best young tennis players in the world has picked Boca Raton as the place to train with hopes of one day turning pro. And Andrew Lawholm live to share why she believes training here will take her skills to the next level. Andrew. We're here at the Everett Tennis Academy where it houses some of the best young tennis players in the entire world. And tonight we met one of the 75 who are enrolled here. It's hard. Being 16, you're really good at tennis. My dream is to become a pro one day. But your hometown doesn't really cater to the sport quite like here. Portland doesn't have as much tennis as down here in Florida. Farida Abdulmonium left Oregon as a number three player in the Pacific Northwest. Her mom moved with her out here in September. She decided to come here with me with the sacrifice of my dad and brother. A typical day is 5.30 wake up, followed by tennis for two hours, fitness for an hour, and then school for four hours. Yeah, I want to go to Harvard. She's enrolled in the online K-12 International Academy, allowing her to train and travel while keeping up with school. Like online school is definitely a good tool for tennis. In the afternoon, it's back out to the court for more tennis. South Florida, I would say, is the mecca of the tennis. Jacobo Teza is the executive director here at Everett Tennis Academy. He recruited her here after she visited for a summer camp. Immediately I saw somebody who was extremely dedicated. I like her work ethic. Um, and most of all, I really like her demeanor. I was so nervous. Her love of tennis was cemented in 2014. She was at a tennis camp in France when she volleyed with her idol and now fellow Palm Beach County resident. I mean, seeing someone like me who looks like me, who plays like me on TV just has inspired me so much. And I've always said I want to be like Serena Williams. Farida has an extra wrinkle to her game. She's lefty. Yeah. Now, that's something really cool about her and her family. They're 100% Egyptian and they're fluent in Arabic. So keep an eye on her, folks. It looks like she's going places. We're live in Boca Raton. Andrew Lafalm, WPTV News Channel 5.